Here is a simple way to make a for cutting a PC board material. This is a Harbor Freight 4 inch table saw, part number 93211. And we'll add a 4 inch diamond blade, part number uh, 95315. The uh, motor on this table saw is a bit underpowered, so you kind of have to listen for the RPM and back off if it starts to uh, pinch and slow down. You want to remove the guides and the safety cover, and what you do is basically just uh, eyeball it and uh, cut the board. You know, can you do a quick demonstration? Here? I think he does a fairly decent job. Um, the, for the uh, thinner PC board material, I like to use a pair of uh, snips from Midwest Tool, model M1200. They got a three and a half inch uh, blades on them, really nice high quality blades. Um, you'll have no problem cutting, making nice cuts on the thinner uh, PC board material, even lengthwise cuts aren't really no problem. But as you can see, it doesn't really bend the board at all, it doesn't uh, twist it or anything like the, some of the cheaper snips will do. And uh, you can do it all in one cut, which is really handy. For uh, deburring, you want to, after you cut your board material, you want to deburr it. I use a standard uh, belt sander to find about a 300 grit uh, belt. just basically helps to square up your edges. It makes it look nice. It gets rid of any uh, burrs or anything. Now for uh, cleaning the PC board. I have a little utility sink here set up. Um, these are the 3M scotch Brite pads. You'll see these at most grocery stores or whatever. And a uh, copper glow. You can find this also at most grocery stores. Um, since I get most of my PC board material from like a ham fest and stuff, it tends to be oxidized or there's dirt on it or crud and stuff like that. And uh, if it gets, if it's really bad, you want to use like a, this uh, flexible uh, sanding foam, also from 3M comes in a pads like that you cut it down and if there's like a really bad oxidized spot you can kind of clean it up beforehand. Um, avoid using steel wool as a it will embed, it can embed little steel fibers into your board material which will make it even worse. Start by uh, just rinsing it under warm water. Add a little bit of a copper glue. Dampen your uh, scotch plate pad and kind of work it in a circular pattern. Make sure to get all the sides and all the corners and stuff. Rinse it off really good. Also, still under warm water. You know, dry it off so it doesn't get all the crud on it or anything. There we go. Fairly clean board, ready for uh, to 
pull out the pattern on.